Check. Hi. I'm on my match in the dark. 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 All right, coming up next, a UFC featherweight division fight. Well, this guy has truly made the takedown a thing of beauty in mixed martial arts. With respect to yourself and George St. Pierre and the truly great takedown artists, this guy's closing the gap and and entering that company in the eyes of men. Oh, absolutely, because he's done such a great job of timing takedowns. You didn't see, I haven't seen anyone so good at slipping a jab into a takedown since George St. Pierre. Right. He does a phenomenal job of getting from step one to step two before his opponent even realizes, now he's in on my leg. And if they do get their hips back, immediately he's up into a foot sweep or a headlock or an inside trip. It's just so many different ways for him to get you to the floor that he will throw every single one at you every single time. And a lot of fighters talk about that wrestling maintenance and how hard it is right over the course of a career to continue to drill those things. He talks a lot about that, and that's why he's continued to realize success here in the U.S. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, Jim. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven foot Kareem Abdul-Jabbar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee, in a nutshell. Just so wise. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Mergliata. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC featherweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 136 pounds. Fighting out of Milan, Italy, Pantera. And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, commit to the rules of the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times, on a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, so back your corners to my fight. Success. I want to see how this plays out. Well, missed on that one. Well, he's doing a nice job here blocking these shots. The chin is tough, the hands are high. Pretty good job defensively thus far. Great job defensively. He's seeing everything coming. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the camera. 
He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Big punch lands over the top. How's he going to follow this one up? Straight right hand now just misses. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Oh, huge block! Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. That one landed clean. Head kick, that's a miss. Just over three minutes to go round one. Lee gets caught with that punch. Oh, perfect timing on the Superman punch. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Lee going for the body, missed with that kick. Oh, massive knee to the body, that can't feel good. What a tricky head kick. Oh, that's a nice strike. Big right hook coming, it's blocked. Lee gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. know when that leg kick's coming. Strong defense here as the hook to the head is blocked. Big ball punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Flush right hand is true. Lands with the right hand. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination there. Very accurate, a lot of activity in the hands. Look phenomenal tonight. Back and forth we go! Big head kick land. Ooh, what a punch. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. And they separate. Nice one, two there. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. Oh, big left hand there. That right hand hurt him a little bit. 20 seconds to go. All right, lands a kick there. Pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. Goes to the body there. It's very tricky. Oh, All right, so there's the end of the round, and the tide has officially turned a huge head strike to stun his opponent. We'll see which corner can adjust here moving forward. I mean, they've got to be celebrating. They've got to be happy. Everything's working. But the other side has to be concerned. They have to figure something out, make some sort of adjustment to try to change the tide of this fight.
throws a big right hand, but doesn't find its home. All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man, let this guy have the whole thing. Telegraph that spinning back fist. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Just missed with the left there. Right hook to the head block. Oh, wow! Head kick. Left hook, right hand. Just out of range with that left hook. Slips. That one's stuck in. Nice play. Just over three minutes now to go. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Just misses with the straight left hand. Nice punch there. Very nice outside leg kick by him there, DC. We'll see if he follows it up here. He's really driving his shin into his opponent's thigh. Beat his leg up. So a much different approach from him here in round two. Took him a while to find the range, get in his striking rhythm. He has found it here, and as a result, has really picked up the pace in round two. And he landed the right hand there. Set up your Look at him whip his hip into that kick. Liver kick. Nice defense there, huge block. Oh, strong punch there by Lee. throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. He's got a serious right punch, and he went to it effectively there. It is his money shot, and he will continue to throw it until he finds a knockout. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. Huge block there. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Oh, that's a good strike there by Lee. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice kick. Oh, and he lands yet another strike to the body. Pinpoint placement right underneath the elbow. Big punch land. And that one certainly found the target. Oh, nice slip to avoid that right hand. Lee's kick to the body is blocked. And that's the end of round number two. A lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a Telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my Telestrator right now, 
That was a great display of high-level mixed martial arts striking. Both combatants stood toe-to-toe -to -toe and let it all hang out. All right, listen. I need you to be more active this round. You cannot wait and try to counter everything. He's getting to you first. I need you to get that head move. You ready? You ready? Let's Third round on. underway. Well, he continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. There's no give on that leg kick. Keeps going back to that jab, keeps throwing that jab, but unable to land. Beautiful punch. Look at the torso on the right side. Major bruising, and it's only getting worse. Lee's kick is blocked. Just misses there with the left. Switching stances here. Good punch, Lance. Trying to establish that jab once again. Oh, continuing to work the body to great effect. Just misses with the left hook. Connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Oh, left hook to the head. It's blocked. Lee gets tagged with a kick now. Let's see if he can wrap. Slips. Oh, misses with the jab. Well, he has really started to apply a lot of pressure here down the stretch. Not as much offense earlier in the fight. He is making up for lost time now. Lee gets caught with that punch. Leg kick. Oh, he looks so sharp tonight. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Oh, tags him with that uppercut. Now we'll see if he can follow it up. Great punch. What does he follow that uppercut with next time? He lands it so effectively. He's throwing bombs. Every time they come into contact, he is throwing bombs. Nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Right hand upstairs. Oh, he's got that right hand going tonight, DC. Connected with it there. He's thrown so many left jabs to throw that right punch straight down the pipe. It's unreal. Big kick lands. I mean, he's cutting him down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Connects there. His hands look good to him. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Oh, 
Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. Big kick land. Head kick there blocked by Lee. Tags him with the left hand. Right now, we take a look back at some of the action in that previous round, DC. A lot to like on both sides here. I mean, both were intent on going forward. And what happens when nobody wants to take a step back? They meet in the middle. That's exactly what they did, and they both found success over the course of that round. All right, so the next round is underway. Will it be more of the same? And by that, I mean all of those strikes to the body. You've got to think at some point the opposition is going to lower that guard or get finished. And that's exactly what he is hoping for. All those great body shots, all that damage he's putting on his opponent will force an opening up top where he will look to finish. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. What a body kick. Nice head kick. Well done to catch the kick. We'll see what he can do. Trying to go to the body now with the kick. That one misses. Got clip with the right hand. Beautiful body. Take deep, take deep. Nice. Oh, another strike to the body. Not a lot of real estate there, but he found it. Still nice body. shot there. Unable to land with that punch. Oh! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Three minutes to go. Oh, straight right. Back and forth we go. Good punch. Two. No! He didn't like that left hand. Dude's oh. hurt. Serve him up. Go get him. Big left hook coming. It's blocked. Right punches there. Under two minutes now to go. Big leg kick lands. Well, he continues to mix it up beautifully on the feet. Nice inside leg kicks there by Lee. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Let your hands go. Let your hands go. Slits the guard, lands the right hand. Way to hide that leg kick. Right hand landed. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Punch lands through the middle. Oh! Oh, he's hurt. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down there. Whoa! What a fan. 
fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Timely defense there. Huge block for him. All right, he engages in the single collar tie. Man, look at his torso. That just came. Whoa! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. This is a great fight. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh! Ten seconds to go in round four. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Buzzer sounds for the end of round four. All right, so there's the end of the round. He stayed committed to doing damage upstairs and landed a seminal blow in that round. It was accumulation of those strikes. He kept hitting him over and over to the head. Eventually, he found the, the one that really did damage his opponent. All right, next round getting underway here, and both fighters still look pretty fresh to me. Clearly, DC, they so put in the right work when it came to the cardio during training. They both have reputations for vast cardio. You see in the training that they do at their gyms that cardio is key, and you watch it in the way that these two fighters perform. Nice strike. Not there. That was a thudding leg kick. I need you to kick now. Just a slip there. Right up the elbow. The body kick land. Liver kick. If you take those kicks, it's going to shut your body off. That's a big strike right there. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proven prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that oh. head kick. Oh, diving punch lands. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. All right, he's trying to control posture here. Now trying to hip escape. He's just trying to move out of this position off the bottom. Back to the feet. Nice kick. Well, he's been pretty accurate tonight. He's landed some significant strikes, but his corner's looking for him to mix it up a little bit more and just throw more volume. Because they don't see too much of a threat. This guy has to have confidence in knowing that when he extends his combinations, he's still safe, but he's also going to be able to land. He's got to be finding that confidence in his mind that all the reps in the training room are going to pay off. Three minutes now to go to decide this one. All right, well, it's late in the fight. Time is of the essence. And when you're clearly losing and you know you need a finish, risk management goes out the window. Oh, yeah. No more risk management. Either get knocked out or you knock him out. One way or the other, you're going to lose. You can lose by decision or you can lose by knockout. But at least when you go for the knockout, you give yourself a chance to try to find your shot. Ooh-wee! Ooh-wee, what a right hand by this young man. Changes his stance. Nice leg kick. Nice punch land. Lands with the kick there, no pad on that foot. No shin guard, he's taking all of that kick every time he throws it. Under two minutes now with which to work. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Game of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. 
big head kick land. Trying to kick the leg out. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Well, you know about the offense, but how about the defense? Overhand blocked by Lee. One minute to go in the fight. Just out of range with that strike. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Lee gets caught by that straight punch. That'll get his attention. What a punch. Ooh, Superman punch lands. Slips. Punch is blocked. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, nice hook by him there. How many times can this young man land this particular punch? What a fight. All right, so the fighters go the distance here tonight, but it went a whole lot better for one of them than the other. Talk us through the replays, champ. Some decisions are different than others, and his striking really did separate him from the competition. He fought so well in the stand-up game that he should get a very easy decision. Looks like the official decision is in. Yes, here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. The judges score the contest. 48-47, 49-46, and 48-47. For the winner, by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon! All right, nice job by him there as he is your winner via unanimous decision. And sometimes I would think it's easier said than done to just leave the judges out of it. Dominant performance and he gets his hand raised. Yeah, and if you gotta go to the judges, leave no question, right? Be the person that is so dominant that you know you're getting your hand raised. He did exactly that tonight and he gets a dominant decision.